Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. If I look like I've been beaten, uh, or it's because I am so, so upset. And uh, it's because I believe that certain test devices that I'm using are complete garbage. And I can, I can say that with some conviction. Um, I would like to give a shout out to the guys over at Renew Biomedical. I reached out to them. To get some insight to make sure that I'm doing some of this correctly and they hooked me up with Josh who is a superstar over there and uh, he guided me into how they do these and um, sure enough I mean I did make one mistake and my mistake was in one of the use menus in ESU energy uh, this guy would come down to 10 ohms but it would never go to zero which the force triads asking for a shorted cable which is zero ohms so um, that's what I did, is I would put it on a vessel ceiling, thanks Josh, <laughs> and that got me down to the zero ohm, so now I'm in range at least. However, this guy, this guy bugs out when it gets up around 5 amps, you know, it gets around 47, 46, uh, 4.6 amps, and it just starts bugging out. This guy needs 5 amps on, on the uh, ligature port. And it just gives me calibration errors. This guy keeps shutting off like mid runs. And when you try and activate it, when you're pushing that many amps, it does not like it. It's, I don't know if I've had such a exhausting and frustrating experience as trying to calibrate. Now this guy here, it did pop some fuses and uh, that's because I was pulling so much current through it. And it gets hot. I mean, you're doing these long burns, it gets hot. So I have a leaf blower to help cool it down so that uh, you know I can you know not wait an hour between tests because there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of heat sinks in there and they stay hot for a while but with the, the leaf blower I can cool down reasonably quickly however between both these devices here it is just not looking good and it is just leading me to nothing but frustration I've gotten um, well I've probably done about four or five takes maybe more and um, it's not even like it's consistent. Like this guy bugs out at different times. This guy here errors out at different times. That the, the two of them just don't cooperate. And um, I'm just extremely frustrated. But Renew Biomedical, uh, Mark, and Josh, thanks guys. I, I appreciate your help. That's the type of help that this community needs is when somebody needs answers, you look to people that have more information than you. And those guys, they clearly do more ESUs than me. And uh, even though I've been doing ORs for 19 years, I mean, don't, you can't, just can't match the knowledge of somebody that does like three or four a day. It's just, that's, that's a lot. So thanks, guys. I do appreciate the help, man. It didn't work out for me, but uh, that's okay. I'm going to push through it. Uh, I'll, I'll see what we can do about it. I don't know. I, I, I think I need to go inside and grab some ice water or something. <laughs> Anyway, guys, y'all have a wonderful day. Um, hopefully your day is going a little bit better than mine. Thanks for watching.